Right, so I'm with Benny Westwood. First interview I've done with you, Benny, since you were announced as joint club captain. How are you, you enjoying that role? Yeah, I've, been, I've enjoyed it so far. It's, uh, I know we've got two from uh, two losses from two, which isn't a good record, but uh, as far as the captaincy goes, I'm, uh, I've really enjoyed it. It's been good and uh, you know, it's a bit of a challenge for me. Uh, you know, I went over the moon when he asked me you know, to be captain of uh, a club that I've you know, I've been for around now for 12 years and you know, moved over into Warrington eight years ago, being a Yorkshire man, you know, to be captain of a town that you know, I've, I've become to love and uh, my family's become to love, you know, it was a great honour, so uh, you know, hopefully you know, at the end of the year it'll, uh, I'll be lifting some trophies and uh, that'll, be the, that'll be the final, final piece we uh, you've, all, you've mentioned the two defeats from two games, I mean, clearly a disappointing start to the season, where do you think things have gone wrong a bit? I, I just, I, you know, we've played against two, you know, two fantastic teams. I think, and you know, Saint Helens, we were, we were way off what we needed, where we needed to be, but in both attack and defence. But more disappointingly, defensively, uh, I thought, you know, last week against Leeds, I thought we, uh, we really improved on, on, on every, in every aspect of the game, and uh, especially our D. We, you know, we worked hard for each other, and uh, uh, there's still a few things that we need to sort out. Uh, and that's what we're hoping to doing this week. If we can improve on last week's game this week, then uh, we're going in the right direction and uh, we'll, be able, we'll be happy. But I mean, Hull performed quite well at Saints, didn't they? So it's not going to be an easy ride. No, it ain't. It doesn't get no easier, Joe. You know, we've, we've had a pretty tough start. And, uh, but, you know, you've got to play them at some point, these tough, these tough teams. And, uh, Joe, you know, why not get them all, all done early? But, uh, yeah, it's going to be tough, it's going to be tough, but we know, we know if we work hard for each other and we, and, and we, we work our socks off and for each other and, you know, and play the kind of, you know, the right weather rugby as well at this, at this time of year, you know, it's not, it's not all about throwing it around and uh, you know, playing the expansive rugby that we do when it comes to summertime, uh, we need to play winter rugby if, as we can call it. It's, it's not exactly summer It's not exactly it? summer, but... Uh, no, and, this, and we do that and work hard for each other. We won't be far off. We won't be far off. It will be a difficult team to beat, and uh, you know, that's what we're that's what we're working to. Are you missing any of the old faces in the team? Oh, uh, but, you know, I'm, I'm missing the, the characters and the training and stuff, I suppose. Uh, but no, we've uh, you know, we lost some we lost some experienced players last year. Uh, you know, with Mars and uh, Cavs and Hodgson, Brad Hodgson and that. Uh, so you know, we fetched some, we fetched some, some youngsters through. who hasn't, who not played much sub league. Uh, we fetched Keith Ingber, Anthony England into, you know, for for Mars and Cars. Uh, so when he hadn't played any super league games at all, so so it's going to take time. You know, I'm a big believer. You know, the more the super, the more games you play at super league, you need to play at super league to be able to get better at. It. Uh, and you know, the youngsters have had a handful of games, and you know, this is the time now. They've got to, they've got to get some game time behind them, and uh, you know, they'll come good. But it takes time. Uh, Joe, and it's, only, it's only two games into the season and uh, Joe, I'm sure Joe, very confident that Joe, these, these players can, can do a great job for us. Now you're joint captain, does it affect the way you think and play on the pitch yourself? You know, I thought about this before, you know, when, when I named and how am I going to play and you know, I've got to change and you know, in two games I've given one penalty away so that's good <laughs> for starters. Uh, I wanted them for holding down but uh, I didn't mind that. Uh, but yeah, I, I thought about it, but I don't think I'll change too much. You know, I'll, you know, I'll work hard and with our team and you know, and try to help others on the on, on the on the field. Uh, you know, but you know, I feel as though <clears throat> talking and stuff. You know, I wasn't a big talker before games and stuff. I like to keep used to like to keep myself to myself. And you know, I feel as though you know, I have to I have to now. And you know, we've got a few youngsters in the team. And I have to you know, lead them and. I you will know, help them through their game, and uh, you know, I think I have done with Joe you know, before games and stuff, and you know, I feel good for it. I feel good for actually doing it, and I just I thought, well, why haven't I done this, Joe, you know, all my life? Uh, so I'm going into games feeling good, and you know, I felt that last week against the Leeds and performance, well, you know, we're back to how I, you know, how I want to be playing, and uh, you know, we're just gonna, I've got to, I've got to move on from here, and uh, you know, hopefully lift, lift some of these young guys and, and some of the old guys with me. Now. You're an experienced player. You, you joint captain on the pitch, Michael Monaghan. He's obviously an experienced player. So who has the final say if you're both on the pitch and the decision has to be made? Me, definitely. <laughs> I've told him. 
he should be doing this. He's, I say, so you could walk me in your work. I'll do it leading on field. Is <laughs> uh, no, is uh, you know, my, Michael's just that kind of guy anyway. Joe, you know, with, you know, with the position that he plays at hooker, you know, he, he has to be vocal and, and tactically minded, and uh, uh, you know, and he's had a bit of experience at Manly when Manly were captain for a couple of years, so uh, he kind of knows. So. Uh, you know, we, we, we take it in turns to do the toss and stuff. I, I like to lead him out onto the pitch uh, into battle, but you know, when we're on the field, I'm sure you know, Michael will do probably most of the tactical side of it all. And uh, you know, I'll just, I don't know, I'm just there to uh, lead, by lead, example. lead by example, hopefully. Yeah. Like scoring that try at Leeds. Yeah, if you want to, if you want to, if you want to say that, then you can, I suppose. Well, you put a lot of effort in to get over the line, didn't you? Well, if you want to score tries and you've got it, don't you? Yeah, okay. Hopefully, you'll be uh, celebrating your first win at the weekend, Benny. Hopefully, yes, hopefully. All right, thanks a lot. Thank you.